Gotta get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way, you included. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? I'm not sure if I smoke. Don't smoke. Then go out and get some. Just need one last one. Jesus fucking Christ, man. The fuck kind of joy toy are you supposed to be? Fucking ghost off! <laughs> Who you work for? Start talking! Fuck. Fuck. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No, wait. Ah. Oh. I'll take control. I'll find a way. You hear me? See you never, asshole. Now like that, stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger. I can feel it. Our minds touch on you. I'm like mold on fruit, creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Fuck me. Alright, I'm alive, I guess. Let's check my weapons first. Oh, shoot, I have plenty of guns. <laughs> I'm not bad. So I think I need to choose what I want. So this is a very good shotgun. Alright guys, I'm ready to rock and roll, so let's leave this uh, apartment. We need to close the door just in case. Oh. Takebra here. We must meet. Come now? to Thomas Diner. Mm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. Yeah, I haven't that's managed true. to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Alright, I'll be there. It looks like I have no other options anyway. Oh, 
Moving side, moving side. Open up. Barry, we know you were in there. We're here to help. Carajo, don't tell no fucking war. So maybe I can buy some ammo. Maybe. You stink of junk food. Or I can just steal the ammo, right? <laughs> Leave me alone, guys. Oh, leave me alone. Read the message from the Mega Building H10 administration. All right. Let's do it. So, messages. Where can I find the messages? Character, journal and maybe inventory no oh maybe database not the database so it needs to be somewhere else oh messages all right i have it so Mac mega building regina jones and delman all right so i think these are the messages and I need to meet with Takemura. So let's find Takemura. The remainder of Mayor Ryan's term will be fulfilled by his deputy mayor and closest associate, Weldon Holt. Holt has also announced plans to run for mayor. I would like to know what he wants. So this is oh, so, uh, cops everywhere. Another cop. So just 125 meters. I'm going to run. Probably. We need to talk. Please, speak up. Yes, Mama Wells. In a minute, I need to talk with Takemura first. Or maybe I... Yeah, a little bit later. Yeah, I don't want to buy any vehicles yet. I really need to make 20 grand to pay off Vic. So Takemura is in this shop, right? Oh, he's here. Okay. Yo, man, Sid, what's up? You do not look so bad. Really? Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. This is about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Varasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. I'm thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? You ask a lot of questions. You have many interesting things to say. Might be your turn now to say something interesting. I intend to punish Yorinobu Arasaka severely for the crime he has committed. Is that all? Really should be going. Wait. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice in Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. 
The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prep for the heist. Thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true. He's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Sokka scums everywhere. Hey! I was listening to that! Shut up! Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Yep. I will rob this shop. <laughs> this is going to be my revenge. Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found, things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. Mean to say you worked for Saburo, yet got no idea how to talk to the High and Mighty. She wished to have nothing to do with the man accused of murdering Saburo Arasaka. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. 
Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. Dolma is choosy, expensive, and rude. <laughs> that is absolutely right. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Paka woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. And what is the plan B? By I the way. cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. All right. Would you drink this coffee? Till then, I guess. <laughs> if by some miracle you find Hellman, I just raised from the grave, and the, the coffee he looks and I really, really good. Finished the business. Can I drink it? Can I drink it? He's, he didn't say anything. Oh, shoot. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. <laughs> That's true. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Really? Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. <laughs> Don't need convincing. See nice. your memories. Gross. Rogel danced any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Yep. Shut up, Johnny. I need to talk with this chica over here. I would like to buy these very tight pants somewhere. Hello, chica. Vamos. <laughs> Maybe I can serve behind the bar. Oh, maybe not. All right. Find Evelyn at Lizzie's bar. So I can call Judy. All right, let's do it. What's up, Judy? Are you there? That you? Yep, alive. I thought you were gone. Not yet. You're not alone in thinking me dead. Thought it was game over for me too. Things went as up, huh? Not as planned. Listen, what do I need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? What I just say. Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I won't? Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Alright, so I need to meet with Judy. And hopefully I still... Oh, I don't have a car? So how far is it? 500 meters. Alright. Stop the car, stop the car. It's mine now. Leave me alone! Shut up. <laughs> and Please. let's drive it. As I stole it, right? 
Oh, sorry. <laughs> and what about now? It is only 500 meters, so it shouldn't take long. Okay, so this one right. Just a scratch. So 300 meters and I will talk with Judy. And it looks like I took a wrong road. Oh shoot, this is bad. So I can make a U-turn somewhere maybe? No, it looks like here. So let's make a U-turn. Yes. Okaku Okada, the lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. Yeah, you I will, I will, I promise. For Sandra Dorset. You did quite well. You and that friend of yours. Until then. Hey, look. Oh, shoot. <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> oh, shoot. Lizzie's is closed right now. So let's read the message. Right, so I should do something else, but I think I will do it in next episode. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one. This is the way.